Hi, welcome to a random city. Sorry for spamming you once again. <laughs> I feel like I have been doing a lot of videos lately, but I think the Chinese um, companies are kind of uh, coming out of their uh, holiday <laughs> season. So, yeah, uh, things uh, keep uh, coming in my mailbox. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, and this came, you know, I have been waiting for these since November last year. <laughs> they got lost in the mail, uh, got lost in the shipments somewhere, and it ended up that with that they actually had to uh, resend these to me. So these are custom made, and it is from Fancels. They are from Fancels. I got it at the time around uh, Black Friday. So for these three together, I paid around $31. That's a very good price. <laughs> so uh, two of them are counted. One of them is uh, stamped. So um, yeah, I'm sorry if you feel like I'm spamming you. You could also say I am spoiling you. <laughs> totally up to you. So uh, let's start with the... Um, they're very special, these ones. Um, let me tell you about them. Let's start with the first one here. I've taken most of it out of the bag. I think the floss is in bags, but um, yeah. So this one is uh, it's an artwork from an artist called... Um, I'm having trouble pronouncing it because she's from Turkey. But... If you should Americanize it, is that a word? Uh, you could call her Julia Ostimir. I think it's something Julia, something, but I have seen her name uh, written in like Julia, so Ostimir. She do, she's doing a lot of uh, these ladies, uh, and um, I have got permission from her to do uh, artwork uh, only for my own personal use. So I have done one in diamond painting, put in a picture here. And I really wanted to do kind of her sister. So this artwork is called in every possible way, but I'm just calling her Red Lady's sister. I will put in a better, better picture of it here. So I decided on a count it. I, I think it's... It, Mainly it was because I wanted 14 count and I was worried that it would be a little bit too, um, I don't know, hard to see the symbols. So I went for a count. Here is the chart. There is 40 colors. And I feel that this could be very, very good actually. I really adores the picture and I love the title in every possible way <laughs> for me this would always be red lady's sister because the other one I, I always call her red lady so I really love this so um, look at this uh, fabric I just love that uh, I got it graded I don't have to draw lines that's so amazing <laughs> So this is uh, 186 or something by 242 wide. They say 40 by 50, so I wonder if that is the whole thing or what. Yes, it is. So a little bit smaller, but that's fine. So really, really nice uh, fabric. So, um, fencers, you have done very nice with this one. I got a toolkit again, a little dolphin. And yeah, the, the, the chart is quite small, but it's very clear. And I think if I take a picture with my phone, um, I can enhance it. So it's easier to read. Here is the picture. 
sorry, floss. <laughs> so we got a whole lot of these, uh, this color 820 blue, very clear blue for the background. And as you can see, my red lady is also with that back background. So, yeah. And you got extra here, black, red, and this beauty. This is uh, 3844. Also very cute. I don't know why I my camera keeps making it a different color. Because this is much more greenish. I don't know if it's something to do with my light. Well, I am struggling with the light all the time. So, quite possibly. So we got it on the first card. Nice. Yeah, colors are as I expected. So beautiful, very soft, very soft indeed. Yeah. So for the colors, I think that's fine. They did kind of uh, simplify the image. And I don't mind that. I tried to um, chat it myself with, uh, I think it was pick to pet but I just couldn't. It, it was so uh, confetti heavy. I No, I just, no, <laughs> I'm not doing that. So I decided when they had this say that I would get it. Okay, that's the first one. Red Lady Sister. Uh, next one is also from a um, artist I got permission from. She's called Sylvie Demers, and this particular one is called Frida. Put in a picture here. So I have to admit, I have a thing for Frida. I I think she. <laughs> I don't know i just love the way she looks i love the way the colors it's so wonderful i think so yeah i decided on this again small chart but uh, clear so i can just take a picture and do kind of page by page so i went for counted with this one also so 39 colors for this this is frida she's sitting with some almost jungle like and she has a dove on her shoulder so very pretty and got a toolkit also here another dolphin and the same with the fabric kind of turned this way instead <laughs> nice yeah I like that so nice that they uh, gritted it for me love that here's the colors So for this one we have another background, 3750. More darker blue, kind of dusty really. And we have these two big ones, 823. Here's the colors. Ooh. <laughs> Wonderful colors. More um, variation kind of. So I need to do something. Yeah. yeah. Beautiful. I don't know what to call those, but it's more uh, um, earthy kind of. I like those colors. Oh man. I think I need to um, do this one. <laughs> soon so maybe i should put it in my little baskets maybe yeah so here's oh look at this one of my favorite colors i just love this yeah again it appears much more blue i think it has to do with my light i need to try and change that it's much more this is called teal yeah i think so beautiful there's a note here so i got the discount <laughs> floss Nuts in. Oh, hope not. 
probably not. So yeah, put that back. I actually really like how they charge it. When you think of um, uh, the price, I think that's excellent. So last one is uh, something I did myself from an AI uh, kind of uh, app, I think it was, or something online. Um, my granddaughter is crazy about this Pokemon figure. I cannot remember what the name is, but... Um, she just adores the little one, so I thought I would do a um, stamped one. Stamped one. I don't know if I can find a picture, and if not, maybe you can see it here. It's this one. <laughs> She's crazy about this one. So, uh, yeah. There was something with the, uh, the app or online. I just typed in the name of that Pokemon figure. And it came up with uh, several, some ideas for a um, picture. So I chose this one. Seems like an easy one. This is the fabric. Oops. So for this one, we have 40 colors also. So you can see the. I'm going to move, move things a little bit. You can see here the big Pokemon is down here. Uh, 147 by 190 and it's 40 by 50 centimeters in total but yeah the fabric is not nice in this one I think it's, it has to do with the stamping every time they stamp on it makes it very stiff but uh, we can make it soften up or I can put it in a frame so yeah. that's the colors it looks right To, um, match match the motif. So this one is probably for the Pokemon. That's a good color, I think. Again, it looks blue. That's crazy how blue it looks. Can I change something? Just a minute. I think it has to do with my color. I have no idea why it does that. Okay, but um, yeah. I don't know how to change that. Probably my phone. It's a shitty phone, what can I say? So this one is color. I can, see. can I see that somewhere? Please have a number 3765. Yeah, these are really good colors. <laughs> I hate you can't see them, right? Uh, need to find out what's going on. It's something I have been struggling with lately. It's not always been like that, so I don't know. Maybe I changed something in settings. Here's the colors. Pretty. Same nice quality. Very soft and shiny. Here's the colors. Again, there are more green tones in that you can see. So I think these are very good for this particular one. Okay, okay, okay. So those were the ones I've been waiting for uh, for a very, very, very long time. Did I show you these last ones? Pretty, pretty. I ordered them in November and asked inqu inquired about it if that's a word in january and then they um, they said that they would um, send it to me again and because it was a custom made they had to make it so it took a little bit longer than normal look at this tool set that's a uh, that came with the um, stamped one. A little scissor. I don't think I've ever gotten that before. <laughs> and a frog thing. 
Oh my god, that's a nice tool set. So, here they all are. What do you think? Do you like them? <laughs> I certainly do. Um, I have no idea what I will be starting with and I don't know when. Um, I probably should be doing this, but I kind of really want to do Frida. <laughs> I love the colors in that one. I also do the... I don't know. That's the dilemma. dilemma. We are always in. <laughs> yeah, so, but um, sorry if you feel like I'm spamming. I hope you feel like I'm spoiling you. <laughs> uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day and week and everything. And I will speak to you in the next one. Take care. Bye bye. Happy stitching.